Hello, welcome to another session of Wiki Procedure and today we're going to look on how you can apply for a dual citizenship in Kenya. Down here below we have given you an external link which is going to direct you to our Wiki Procedure page where we have given you detailed information on how you can go about the application process. We have also included external links to sites where you can visit and get more information about dual citizenship in Kenya. And we've also included external links to office locations where you can submit your form, or visit the immigration department. And uh, most importantly, we have included the, uh, the link to the uh, foreign national service uh, portal where you can initiate the application process through the online application portal. We are going to visit this as we move on with the presentation. Uh, but for now, I want you to shift your attention to the right hand side of the screen and here we have the select language option and by with the select language option, you can choose your preferred language and by choosing the preferred language, the language of your choice, the, the wiki procedure page will be translated uh, into that language which you have chosen. Like for our example, I have chosen Kiswahili and what this has done, this has translated the page into Kiswahili for uh, Kiswahili is the native national language of Kenya, but you can choose any other language which you find uh, easy to comprehend. So, but for our example, you are going to continue uh, in English and let's get back to our presentation so the list of items which are going to cover in this session include the need for a dual citizenship the eligibility the required document steps to follow while making the application the fees applicable validity period processing time office locations and contact information and we'll also look at any other relevant information that is going to add on um, information on how you can apply for your dual citizenship in Kenya. So today's presentation, today's procedure is brought to you by wikiprocedure.com. Let's get on. The need for a dual citizenship is that the dual citizenship allows one to get to gain rights of both countries. So in the case a Kenyan a citizen of Kenya has the right to enter, exit, remain and reside anywhere in Kenya. And um, you having a dual citizenship, you will uh, have uh, access to those the same rights uh, a Kenyan has. The only oh sorry about this. The only thing which you can't do, you cannot vie for for uh, presidency. You can't vie for public office, but you can have every other uh, right. You are eligible to every other right as a any other Kenyan. You can own property, you'll have, uh, you'll be taxed as the same as Kenyans uh, who are uh, citizenship by natural birth, by birth, uh, sorry. And yes, that's the need for the dual citizenship. The eligibility is that the applicant must be at least 18 years of age and above. The required documents, uh, you need uh, two copies of the application form which you can print online you're going to see how you do can do that two passport photos a photograph a copy of your birth certificate copy of a kenyan passport copy of your kenyan identity card copy of the other country's passport copy of the other country's citizenship certificate sorry about this and the applicant must ensure that they are lawfully pres present in kenya as they wait for the application to be finalized you also need a copy of the police clearance certificate. You can find uh, the procedure on how you can get the police clearance certificate at wikiprocedure.com. Just go there and type on the search uh, option, how a police clearance certificate Kenya, and you'll be directed to on how you can f uh, get your clearance certificate. So the steps to follow is uh, number one, you should uh, make the application online so you need to visit the foreign nationals uh, service um, online portal and create an account or login if you have uh, the account and make the application for uh, your dual citizenship I'm going to show you how you are going to do that and after that uh, 
after you have filled in you should go ahead and make the payment uh, uh, you, uh, you, uh, after filling in you are supposed to go and print the application form so let's just look on how you can go about the process so um uh go to fns which is foreign national service dot immigration dot go dot ke and click on the apply button uh, by clicking here the apply button is going to take you to your dashboard if you have the if you have the your login credentials uh, you can just log in but i'll show you what to do if you don't have a uh, if you don't have a login you, what you need to do <clears throat> is to create an account and you can create an account by uh, entering the www.immigration.go.ke and uh, clicking the create account option by cl clicking this option it's going to direct you to uh, this page where you have to now to register select which uh, if you're a Kenyan citizen or a foreign resident and proceed which is going now to create you to create an account for you and you in your account you can now choose you can choose which type of application you want to make so click here on uh, new applications that is going to direct you to this page and uh, under new application go to citizenship uh, services choose the dual citizenship uh, option and click on apply now by clicking on apply now it's going to take you to the next page and uh, at the next page you can you will be given uh, a list of the requirements which you need to make sure you have with you which we've already mentioned the birth certificate kenyan passport the clearance certificate the police clearance certificate you can also download a checklist to uh, help you verify that you have everything and after you have read through and make sure you have all these requirements click on the apply button which is going to now to take you to the online application form which you need now to fill in and print so you need to fill in your immigration file number, your surname, um, your gender. You should note that the 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 the, inform, the required information marked with the red asterisk is uh, it's, you have to give those information and you cannot uh, skip those information. So your physical location in Kenya your kenyan uh, citizenship if it's by birth registration or natural naturalization just go ahead and fill all these and after you've already filled and up uploaded your police clearance certificate go ahead and uh, print your print your application form and after you have printed your application form you are going now to present the application form to the visit the immigration offices with the uh, application form you can visit the immigration offices in mombasa kisumu or kenyan missions abroad for the purpose for your fingerprints to be taken and your digital photograph and drop the application form and you're also supposed to appear uh, to, to appear there in person and no one uh, you cannot send someone to I apply for you or on your behalf for the dual citizenship present the required documents and after lodging your application the uh, your dual citizenship status uh, papers will be ready after 15 working days and you will be uh, receiving information to come and collect your 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 uh, papers in by via email or through text message I uh, have to note that the application is free of charge and no charges. Uh, there is no charge that uh, is applicable. You are not charged anything for dual citizenship. The validity period is that a citizenship by birth does not lose its citizenship by acquiring the citizenship of another country. 
However, an, an individual who has assumed a Kenyan citizenship as an additional citizenship can revoke it and maintain his or her citizenship by birth. So that's the twist. The processing time is five days, uh, 15, five days, uh, and your, your dual citizenship will be ready. The office location, we already mentioned, they're at Nyayo House in Nairobi. You can also visit them at www.immigration.go.ke and other information is that by Kenyan law, every dual citizen shall disclose his or her other citizenship in the prescribed manner within three months of becoming a dual citizen. Also, a dual citizen who fails to disclose his dual citizenship in the prescribed manner commits an offense and shall be liable on conviction of a fine not exceeding five million or imprisonment of a term not exceeding three years or both. The dual citizenship application document is generated online from the electronic foreign national service portal and applicants must ensure that they are lawfully present in the country as they await for their application to be finalized. So thank you for watching Wiki Procedure. Go ahead and hit the like button and go ahead and also hit the subscribe button in our YouTube channel. Um, I'll also ask you to browse through our videos. We have many videos detailing different applications and different procedures on how you can go about different things, in, not only in Kenya, but the entire world. Also visit our wiki procedure page and get to, to search through uh, our procedures. We have dozens and dozens of procedures and we also have procedures for specific counties for all the 47 counties in Kenya. So once again, thank you for watching and I wish you all the best in your quest to get an, your dual citizenship in Kenya. So once again, like and subscribe, share, all the best. Thank you.